This is our second video about paperclip assembly. In the first video, we briefly mentioned half clips. We're going to talk about them a little bit more here. So let's do an example with uh, two of our parts. We have our backbone part and we have our light switch part. For each part, we're going to order four pieces of single-stranded DNA. We have one part that is upstream forward, forward strand, upstream, downstream. This is the reverse strand. Um, these bases match the bases in our part. And prepended to this, we have GCC. We also get a uh, upstream reverse piece. And these overlap um, about 40 bases of the part. We also do a downstream forward and downstream reverse. And appended to the downstream reverse is a CGG. We do the same thing for all of our parts. Upstream forward with GCC prepended. Upstream reverse that just matches the, uh, the DNA sequence of the part. Downstream forward, downstream reverse with CGG appended. And that is our single-stranded DNA that we order from a DNA synthesis company. Now two of these pieces, the upstream forward and the downstream reverse parts, can be used as PCR to extract our parts to amplify them either from the iGEM uh, plasmids or from any part, any gene that we want to get from nature and, and use in our iGEM protein. We can use these as primers for a PCR reaction to extract those. With the rest of this single-stranded DNA, we put these two pieces together in each case. And this is a reaction that can be done in parallel. A very simple reaction. The, uh, the two parts will simply anneal. Two pieces of single-stranded DNA simply anneal together and we can do all of these reactions in parallel so that it's a fairly quick easy to organize activity and this gives us our library of half clips when we're ready to do, do an assembly we'll combine half clips together don't use all of our half clips um, because we'll use uh, some of them hopefully in future uh, reactions if we want to change the order swap new parts in so we use just as much as we need to build our full clips. This is, once again, a very simple reaction. Once again, it's a reaction that can be done in parallel for all of the full clips that we want to make. We just mix these two half clips together. The complementary base pairs in our, our single uh, strand overhangs will anneal together. And then we have some DNA ligase in there fix the next. And that gives us our full clips for our assembly reaction. And that is it.